Earnings season continues this week and tech giants got hit again with Meta being the only exception. We'll reveal the winners and losers that drove 72% of the index performance and which companies will announce earnings next week. As usual, don't forget to subscribe to understand how individual stocks impact the S&P 500. Let's jump right into today's S&P saga. The S&P 500 closed the week at 5,346.56, down 2.1% from last week, losing $1.2 trillion of market Cap. The PE ratio, based on current price and the latest earnings, stands at 27.94, down 0.58 points since last week. Let's go to your gainers. Meta is up 56.9 billion or 4.8% as the company posted better than expected earnings and guidance. Apple is up 29.1 billion or 0.9% on no specific news. Mastercard is up 19.5 billion or 4.8% following better than expected second quarter results. United Health is up 18.4 billion or 3.5% on no specific news. McDonald's is up 17.8 billion or 9.8% following the announcement of a menu revamp after earnings fell short of expectations. Moving to losers, Amazon is down 151.9 billion or 8% after reporting weaker earnings result than expected for its second quarter. Nvidia is down 142.4 billion or 5.1% on reporting of two ongoing antitrust DOJ investigations. Microsoft is down 124.4 billion or 3.9% as the company was the target of a cyber attack against its office products. Intel is down a whopping 42 billion or 31.5% after posting disastrous earnings, announcing significant job cuts, and suspending the dividend. Tesla down 38.7 billion or 5.5% on reporting of a crash caused by its FSD software. This week, there are no changes announced to the S&P 500, so what should you look out for next? week. Earnings season continued last week with over 166 S&P 500 members reporting earnings, and 77 S&P 500 members will release earnings during the week ending August 9th, 2024. And most interesting will be Caterpillar and Amgen on August 6th, Disney on August 7th, and Eli Lilly on August 8th. Which companies do you think will top the list next week and why? Let us know in the comments below and subscribe for our weekly updates. To find out why Alphabet, Nvidia, and Apple were down last week, you should watch this video next.